Why is this place even called Desert Island? Maybe they should call it Bug Island. I mean, there's plenty of those. Miss Shiny, that is a very interesting point. Mr. Conductor, do you have a hypothesis about the island? <laughs> Indeed I do, buddy. The island's ecosystem is out of balance. And the Changyraptors may be the reason why. What do you mean the ecosystem is out of balance? Is it like when I spin around in a circle too fast? Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Not quite, Dawn. You see, ecosystems thrive only when all the plants and animals are in balance with one another. But too much of one thing and not enough of another can have disastrous consequences. Hmm. How about a little demonstration? Shiny and tiny, could you please teeter-totter? <laughs> You see, it's easy because both sides are perfectly balanced. Now see what happens when Dawn and Buddy get on the same side as Shiny. <laughs> Too much on one side put the teeter-totter out of balance. And it's the same for an ecosystem. In this case, as the Changyraptor family has gotten bigger... There's more and more Changyraptors eating more and more lizards which means there's less and less lizards to eat the plants and bugs. Which is why there's so many bugs! Too much of one thing and not enough of the other. Out of balance. Of course, that's just a hypothesis. We'll need more evidence to know for sure. Chandler said his family's nests are that way. Oh, oh my. my. These are all Changyraptor nests? Bless my wingspan. Grandma, take a look at who's come to visit. Mr. Conductor! Oh, you haven't changed a bit. Except now you're all grown up. <laughs> Pteranodon family, I'd like you to meet Mr. and Mrs. Changyraptor, two of my very first passengers. Nice to meet you, Mr. and Mrs. Changyraptor. Are all these nests yours? <laughs> oh, no, no. That one belongs to our son, Chester Jr., his wife, Charlene, their sons, Chester III, fourth and fifth. And that one's our daughter, Charmaine, her husband, Chip, their kids, Charles and Chantel, Chip's sister, Cherry. That's a lot of family. <laughs> and that's not even all of them. I wish we could introduce you to them, but they're all out looking for food. Which has been a tad more difficult to find these days. Oh, my, yes. And there are so many more bugs and plants. It's changed so much since we first arrived here. Well, the conductor has a hypothesis about why. Really? Well, I'm sorry to say, but uh, my hypothesis is that your huge family has put Lizard Island's ecosystem out of balance. Huh? Our family? Well, you see, as your family has gotten bigger, you've been eating more lizards, which means there are less lizards to eat the bugs and plants. <laughs> That's why there are so many bugs and plants. Hmm. I don't think so. Oh, we love this island and would never do anything to harm it. And there's still plenty of lizards. They're just harder to find is all. I know that sometimes hypotheses can be wrong, but I think this one's right. Yeah, we just need to prove it. I think I know just what to do. Dinosaur, once upon a time there was a mom. Her name was Mrs. Pteranodon. Sitting on her nest, she heard a scratching and said, Oh boy, my eggs are hatching. One by one.